firefighters trained on life-saving skills. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. That's right. We watched members of Nebraska Task Force One and the National Guard save lives just a few short months ago. That partnership is rare and growing stronger all the time. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Bailey Bischoff has more details in our top story tonight. Bailey? These helicopters behind me helped rescue 66 people during Nebraska's historic flooding in March. And today we saw up close and personal how those rescues happen. When disaster strikes and people are stranded, their lives hanging on the line, there's a dedicated group of Nebraskans you can count on. Whether you're, you're in a boat uh, helping people or if you're coming, coming in from a helicopter, you know, we're all there to do the same thing and that's help out whoever we can. We saw it in March, the Nebraska National Guard and Nebraska Task Force One rescuing 66 people with helicopters right after floods hit and 106 people in total. It was the worst weather conditions I've ever flown in. He says that's why they have to train. Thursday morning, members of the Nebraska National Guard and Nebraska Task Force One teamed up once again to rehearse these same life-saving techniques. And this training is to simulate um, an experience that we did encounter during the floods where we've got victims in the house surrounded by rushing water. We've got to get them out, but our only option, uh, we can't use the first level of main entry point. While National Guard aviators flew overhead, Task Force One crew members dropped from the helicopters and into homes destroyed by floods near Ashland to rescue Guard members posing as flood victims. You can see them here cutting a hole in the roof and pulling a man out. Taking techniques both crews have been using for years to a whole new level. Bridging that gap between military and civilian uh, response agencies is a, is a big win for us and the state. It's a team effort that's largely unprecedented. They say only about six other states have partnerships like this one. And it's been proven to save lives right here in Nebraska. It's a it's an honor and a humbling experience to be able to help people out and you know once you kind of uh, make access to, to somebody and you know that they're they're okay and you're able to kind of get them secured and then once you're you know going to safety whether that's in a boat or you know up to the helicopter you know it's just a a, a good humbling experience and a little bit of a sigh of relief that you know everything's going to be okay they say this relationship between the Nebraska Task Force One and the National Guard is invaluable and will absolutely contribute to lives saved. In Ashland, Bailey Bischoff, Channel 8 Eyewitness News. Very uh, interesting to get that.